Bad Jimmy starts, well, 1354 first quarter. So early on, this is the first third down of the game. And uh, let's see what he does. This is, again, third and five. Hold on. Yeah, third and five. Yeah, he's going he's gonna to miss this on the out to, uh, to the running back. Yep. And what I would say is, hold on. Jack, you tell me. It's not fair. Sometimes you watch, you watch the, these clips and you say, well, this guy was open. Um, what's the read on this? Is, is McKinnon the read? Because to me, 85 is open like now. Well, I, I'm thinking he's reading those three, but it looks like I don't see Kittle open. He's got two linebackers between him and Garoppolo. Okay, fair yeah, enough. On, on his break. Um, so, yeah, he's definitely got to read the left side. That's one. This is one of those where, where if you're looking at it, you're going to notice that Bourne's wide open on the bottom side, but he's never ah. looking that way. This play is designed to go to the left. He's like okay. going that way from the, from the beginning. He's looking at Kittle. Kittle's covered by 55. Yep. And you got 51 kind of coming over. So he's, he's – That'd be a tough he's, throw he's between those to, two. That'd be tough. Yeah. yeah. You're asking for you trouble. Him, you can see him go to his second read, and then he he finally just drops it off to uh, to McKinnon in the flat. Okay, so you you wouldn't you wouldn't crush your quarterback for, for this play here. There's not well, a lot he can one, do. I wouldn't if if that's the way that the play was designed. Like I said, the only thing is is he is is he gonna, is he picking the side of the field before he snaps the ball? I don't, I don't know uh, how Shanahan's designed that because if because if that's the case, he definitely has Bourne open here. But Bourne, otherwise, Bourne's where, where's Bourne? Bourne's right right where right where Arrow is. Right here. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Yep. You're right. Good eye, Jack. But, yeah. Uh, but he never looked at that side of the field. He's a half field reader a lot of the time. Right. And the other thing, too, I'd, I'd point out on this one is this is his first throw of the game. He's getting hit on his right leg as he throws the ball. Oh, good eye. Let's look at that. The right leg. This is the first third down of the game. Okay. Right, right after he throws the ball. He yeah. Yeah. I wonder if they coached the guy to do that. It almost looked like he did it on purpose. It almost looked like a little Greg think... Williams thing. Hey, hit eight. Yeah. Tap that tap that leg. See how it feels. Get his attention. <laughs> well, you can't see it from that angle. Hey, good eye, Jack. See, this is why we need to have we need to do this together because you're much more observant than me. Um, let's go to the next clip. This is later in the first quarter. Um, almost at the end, 54 seconds left. And here we go. This is, again, third down, third and seven at the Niners' 42. Why did I flag this one? As soon as oh. he hits his back foot, he's got Ayuk open on the – on the Exactly. Go route. And that's a throw that Fitzpatrick was making all game with no hesitation, right? Yeah. Yeah, you it's, see, that's, you know – Exactly. And, and you know, on the first play of the game, when Fitzpatrick throws this ball, he's got less separation than, than here. But right at that point, Ayuk's, Ayuk's got his man beat. He's on top yep. of him a little bit here, and he continues to gain separation. The free safety is way in the middle of the field. There's no way he's going to get over there. And there's, it's not even a consideration out. that he's going to throw this ball. I mean, you got to think he sees it. You got to think he sees it. But I don't think he wants to throw that ball. It's a low percentage pass, and it's not his game. So he throws this one instead. To a guy who's covered. Yeah. That's a tough he's one. Covered. He's really he's well covered. covered. Him. So this is again, I don't know. What do you if you see a quarterback pass up this read, what are you thinking if you're his coach? Well, I, I would just ask him what he's what he's saying. Because I you yeah. know, he's open right here. Yeah. I, I don't know why he's not going there other than Garoppolo tends to to take the shorter routes a lot of times on things like this. Uh, I mean, he forces the ball to Bourne. That's his guy. Uh did he see Ayuk? Did he did he not like the did he not have confidence that he can make the throw either way it's it's a discouraging rep from jimmy and i think a lot of people are like well he was hurt he was hurt you can't blame him for his performance this has nothing to do with his ankle here nothing yeah it's in, in the throw in the throw to Bourne's a bad one if he throws this to his inside he might be able to make the, a little bit better play because of where the good defender point. is on him good but point. it's just a bad it's a it's kind of a bad read and a, a ball bad where the, the location of the ball yep if you put it like here instead of here yep fair point the defender's got to go through his back more Okay, next bad Jimmy clip. Let's keep them coming. 455 second quarter. This is going to be third and 14. Where are you at? Okay. All right. Yeah, this is one of his first throws of the game, really. Okay. I forget this one off the top of my head. So he steps into the pot. He steps into it. Ooh. 
he hesitates. He's got Samuel he, wide open. Yeah. He just okay, so you can't really see how atrocious this is from this angle, but watch. This is the one. Watch his right foot. He's got pressure, I guess. He steps up. Watch his feet. Right here is where he's feeling the pressure. Yeah, that. The ball. That. And you could say, oh, he's getting everything he, he has into it, or he's getting that foot out of there because he doesn't know where this guy is. He doesn't know where this guy is. I don't know. You're not in his head. But it's just, ooh, that little hop, too. The little hop. Um, on from the, You know, see what I'm saying? And then he misses yeah. by like, ooh, that's not Jimmy. That's bad. Yeah. I mean, what do you see there? Well, his footwork's all messed up here on this. First thing is his his lead foot's stepping way off to the side. So he's kind of stepping in the bucket yep. and he throws the ball. And so that's where he's losing his arm, his arm strength, really. Yep. And then he's, you know, the follow Trying through the hop, that it. would make sense with his with his ankle hurting. But, yes, you know, this is just a bad, a bad ball. Uh, when you see a quarterback throw something like this in the game, are you thinking you got to talk to him, honestly? But to me, it's thinking, like, are you seeing ghosts? Are you concerned about getting hurt? It's a guy who's not going to last in the game much longer to me. Uh, this looks like Brian right. Hoyer at the end with the Niners yeah, in 2017. He, you know, and by this point, he'd been getting hit a lot. This is, yeah. this is coming right after the blindside hit on the Dwelly miss. Oh, that was – from the press box, you could see that coming. It looked like the guy was running at Dwelly unblocked for like eight hours. You know what I mean? It was like slow motion. Was like, no! Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. I felt bad for Dwelly. It was the, his one snap of the game, and that's – oh, jeez. Yeah. Brutal. <laughs> my guys, my guys. Okay, 150 second quarter. I think we're getting to the picks now. Um, here. Okay. Let's see. This whole series right here is, is just a really bad series by the 49ers because you've got the, the first pass, Brian Garoppolo gets knocked down to the line of scrimmage. That's a bad one on the other line. Right. The second play is a, is a completion to Bourne that he drops. And so instead of getting a third and three, maybe a first down on that one, you're dealing with a, four, with a third and ten. That's right. And you're, you're play, passing, passing, passing when you can't protect him. He's getting hit, and, and this is about to happen. So keep going. And, and this one's really well covered by everybody across the board. You know, I, I would almost say you don't throw this ball. If you're going to throw this ball to McKinnon, if you go hold and roll it, he, this is really bad ball placement again if you are going to make this throw. He's covered. He's got, you know, there's – Yeah. You know, I mean, if you want to say he's open, okay. But that ball's got definitely got to be over to the box more, which is towards the sideline between the, the, the numbers and the sideline. Instead, he yeah. lays it up in the air. It just hangs, and and that's an easy pick by the free safety. Is there anywhere else he should have went on this play, or you just it doesn't matter? You can't throw this ball. The other, well, the, here's the thing: the, the receivers are covered, but the running back is open. As you keep rolling, if we're going to talk, stop right here. Mm -hmm. If we're going to talk about him not throwing that ball to Ayuk because Ayuk was open, then you're going. You have to say that that uh, McKinnon's open here as well. Okay, this ball needs this ball needs to come out uh, and be out here. Yeah. yeah, yeah, really close He's one towards the line and really yeah. make the running back have to go. So that way it's either caught by McKinnon or it's an incompletion. The worst thing you want to have on that throw is an incompletion. Well, what about – uh-oh. What about the wide receiver at the top of the screen? I know, again, he's only going to read half the field because he's Jimmy Garoppolo, but what's up? Well, I thought he – let's go take a look at it. It's Bourne. Or I don't know who it is, actually. I mean, does he not win at the line of scrimmage? Is he not open as – is he not as open as Ayuk was? Now it's third and ten, yeah. but still – I don't yeah, know. He started. He's coming open, and it looks like on this one, his you know Garoppolo wants to go to Kittle over the middle first. He pulls it yes. back down, and that's when he throws the the really I bad see. ball. I see. So up. he's looking. He's looking at 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 Bourne over he's here. He's looking that way. He's looking to yep. Bourne. Pulls it back yep. down. Pulls it back. So that must he's have been Debo McKinnon. out there. Yeah, I and think he throws right. it to McKinnon. And this <sighs> ball, if this ball outside, we're looking honestly. At, you know, if it's over here, it. yeah, yeah, you this know, is terrible of, placement. Think of the throw. It's on a similar play to this that that Mullins made against the Jets. It's almost yeah. the same play where Mullins is looking to the right, except for on that play, Mullins Giants. is looking to the right. Uh, is it the Giants yes, or the Jets? Correct. Yeah, Giants. Yes, One of to McKinnon. Things. Yeah, to McKinnon. It's, yeah, it's the throw that he makes to McKinnon. It's kind of the same thing, but on that throw that he made, when he makes this throw to McKinnon, when Mullins does, he throws this ball outside, makes McKinnon adjust and, and catch the ball, whereas this one's just hung up, on, you know, and it's it's thrown into no man's land. With where you Again, his ball. footwork is just all over the place, man. I mean, why why did he not why did he not get it out where he needed it to be? Because his feet weren't weren't set. He yeah, missed definitely. way inside. Anyway, all right, last Jimmy, and then let's get to the coaches. Um, because I have some questions with them too. This is 26 seconds left in the first half. 
And this is the second pick. This is pretty much the end. And again, I, I, you blame Garoppolo, but Shanahan didn't need to be calling these passes in this situation. Uh, they, should um, be in, they should be in the, in the locker room right here. They should be in the locker room. Right so this is sec, third and 10. What's going to happen here? Just a He's got him open. Yeah. He's got him open on at the second level. This is a throw that we've seen Garoppolo have a lot of trouble with though, uh, in San Francisco, where they have a kind of a deep, a deep curl with another a secondary curl or in right behind that. Mm -hmm. He has a hard time getting over the first guy and into the second one. And again, his feet are all mixed up. Look where he's that he's stepping down the left. seam on the left yeah. side. And that ball comes out, his arms down, his arm, it's just a it's just a he's all out of whack at this point. Yeah, watch the feet. You're not gonna be able to you're not gonna have precise ball placement if you're if you're stepping away from the throw, I'm sorry. Um, now you could say he didn't have a clean pocket, but geez, if you can't make that throw, you can't, you shouldn't attempt it. Yeah, no, it's, it's a, it's a rough pocket, but it's one that he should have been able to make.